And one of those happy stars is Sean Doyle, a Labrador City native whose resume includes shows like Big Love, Desperate Housewives, Saving Hope, and Republic of Doyle, as well as feature work in movies like Frequency and Whiteout. Most recently, Sean took on the role of John A, as well as starring in his very own series, Endgame. So the pre-party to the disappeared, one of the best actors in the world, Sean Doyle, how are you? Where is he? Who is he? I'm not kidding you. Daniel Day Lewis no, is here. Sir, Le Sean Doyle. Nice All you. right, no, it's true. What's the one line of dialogue you remember? I'm some effing sick of all you. Really? Yeah. You were kind of yeah. angry, eh? A little. Uh, uh, but he's underneath... an angry guy who ultimately kind of opens his heart towards the end of the film. See now, okay, and I'm glad you said that because underneath it, there's a soft side to Pete. You just want to see that. I do, because no, that's was. the kind of person I am. He was a scared man, you know, he's running away from intimacy. He never really had it in his life, and uh, and I think he finally discovers it with these men, right. of all people. You got him? What were you doing? She got my boots, boys. <laughs> she got my boots. What are you doing? Stay together. That's the rule. Come on. I'm sorry. We got you. Okay. We got you. We got you. I'm sorry. Well, last time I interviewed Sean, you said I don't watch anything. Are you going to go to this screening tonight? Oh, yeah. Okay. Yeah, of course. Yeah, but normally when I go to screenings of stuff, I've already seen it. Like you know, for the movie that I produced or had a, a more creative hand in, then I've seen it a number of times. So you're going in like fans like us. Yes. Fan of Shandy Mitchell, without a doubt, because yeah. that was a beautiful script. Now, what about that? I just, I, I know, I gotta let him get back to the party. There's lots of people that want to hang out with you, um, but it's, it's like a, it was, it was like a stage play. Am I wrong in saying that? In that, you had nothing to work with. I mean, there was no CGI. There, it was all real. It well, was, first of all, as an actor, that stuff. Yeah. No actor wants to work with that stuff. It's no. terrible. CGI and trying to, you know, stuff that's going to be manufactured after the fact. That's, 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 that, that makes the process of make believe much more hard. Yeah. You know? Um, yeah, it is. A, it's, it's like, a, it's like a, a teleplay or a radio play or a stage play for sure. And it really just relied on the ability for all of us to connect and for these character relationships yeah. to develop. And that's exciting because we don't often get a chance to do that anymore. Um, but ironically, you know, in bigger projects where often the actor's work is impeded by the camera movements and the elaborate lighting setups and everything, we thought this would be a kind of a bare bones situation where no, it would just be about the acting and we could do take after take and really explore it. Well, if the light changes because the sun moves and we got to drag a friggin' dory around, right. that's like a half an hour, an hour work in order to get the anchor moved around, to get the camera set up again. So no margin for error. Yeah, it's a miracle that a movie like this could be shot in 15 days. It really is amazing. That 15 days? That was it? 15, I know, yeah. And some of them were very stormy. Some were Remember stormy. Remember that? Yeah. There were days when we were out in 12, 14 foot waves. There swell. was wagering that was going on on Twitter. Oh, I don't think they're going to make it. Really? No, I'm kidding. But we're Probably. glad you did. And what an awesome movie. Congratulations and so good to see you again. Thank you. You too. Wait, now, before we let you go, The Return. You have a new project. You can't talk to me about it. Oh, I can talk. I just can't talk to you in depth about it. It's, um, it's uh, Return is a Spanish-Canadian co-production. It... Well, it, you have a great accent in it. No. Can you do Spanish I for will. me now? Do it for me now. I don't get out much. I can't do a Spanish Do accent. something. I can't do Come accents. On. I can only do them when, you know, I have a script in front of me. No, the movie's a zombie movie, of oh, all things. What? Not really, but it's it's set in the world of uh, a sickness that's taken over, the, uh, taken over the planet. And it's about four characters who are struggling to find the antidote. See, now, when I heard The Return, I said, this is a romantic movie. No. It is a romantic movie. <laughs> it is. 
I just did a terrible, terrible job of describing what it is, but you'll oh, learn we, about it soon enough. And I can't wait and for you'll that. you'll correct me. No, sir. Good yes, to see you. You too.